Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play 60 Seconds. My name is Weasel, and we're gonna start a new game in the regular, normal, fat man difficulty. And I really want to get rescued with people being alive. That would be fantastic. Uh, I'm gonna go for a totally regular run, nothing special, no pro gamer achievement, I don't know. Uh, we're just going to try to grab the best items possible. This is a good room. Wife radio. Um, I think we're gonna start with uh, our favorite daughter. What's her face? I forgot her name. Mary Jane! Yes, still you're my favorite daughter, trust me, even though I forgot your name. I still like you a whole lot. Alright, uh, that was more in this room that I would like, but I'll grab the water and the med kit. Ooh, playing cards. Always a good one. Arr, arr, uh, I always forget that the med kit needs two slots. What a shame. I always forget that. I still want that book. I'm still gonna get it. Here, Timmy, come here and I'll take the ammunition. Or water. Water, that's that's fine too. It's basically the same. Yeah, this room is pretty great. Has all the important items you could ever want. I'll take the gas mask, thank you. In including important item. My wife. Uh, give me that water, give me that radio. Eh, I feel confident that this is not at least the worst run. So, let's not totally screw it up and just grab some food and some water. Oh, that's more food. That was not water weasel. Oh no, oh, oh no, so close, no, <laughs> that was so close, that was so close, ah, I got too greedy, that was actually a fantastic run, I feel, I'm gonna be really upset when I see all the stuff we have, <sighs> okay, I'm just going to assume that a flood would ruin anything anyway, so, I think I can do better. I'm just going to pretend that I can do better. Yeah, this is this is what happens most of the time. I kind of get greedy. I die, and then we have to try again. <sighs> I enjoy this mode anyway, so I'm okay with doing it again. Okay, this time. Uh, let's see where everything is. The layout last time was better, I feel. There's a lot of food in here. Okay, let's rate this first. Where's Timmy? Okay, Timmy's in the hallway. Now oh, some practical items. Oh, it's got book. Remember, this is two, so you don't stand around for too long. Just keep running. Whee and there was something. Ah, oh, it was just water in here. I'll take the water, and I'll take my son. Thank you very much. And this thing, and my daughter. Should not be a problem. Come here, daughter. And there's... Somewhere there's water. There you go. Oh, it's poison. Close enough. Not really the kind of... Liquid I do like to drink, but it's practical nonetheless. Grab this, grab that. Ooh, the axe. I would love the axe. But first, wife. It's a little bit more of a priority right now. Is the saving of lives. Ooh, I'll take the map, thank you. Okay, rifle, flashlight, gas mask. Super practical items. I'll have them all, thank you. And I think I can do one last run with food. I'm not gonna have a m mask. Oh god, you gotta be kidding me. <sighs> have you seen how close this was? Have you have you any idea of how close I just got to a wonderful stocked shelter here? Yeah, I grabbed some more food. This was such a great shelter. Ah, uh, you know, freeze a charm or freeze the charm, whatever you say. Free free Alle guten Dinge sind drei, as I like to say. Yeah, let's throw some Deutsch in here. Can't can't get enough of that. Can't get enough of ah <laughs> doing the scavenge mode. I'm gonna like it. If if I fail the third time, you're not gonna see this video because that means that I'm gonna start over. But um, yeah, let's come on, come on, wifey. Actually, your model looks really weird. So does mine, by the way. I don't know. I do like the comic style more than the 3D models, but I think it's cool that you have this mode. Um, doo -doo 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 -doo. Yeah, imagine the game was all 3D, and they were just sitting there as 3D models. I don't think it would have the same charm. There's something to the style that I really like. Okay, give me the axe and this, and I think I still don't have my son. Son, oh yes, come, come with me. I have great plans for you. So you really gotta be wary of that friggin' timer. Great, you got a checkers board, Weasel. Great job. Okay, the bathroom is gonna be next. And give me that. 
Mm, because this time I'm gonna get for ra uh, go for radio. Last episode I did not have a radio, and you've seen how that went. Not great at all. Let's throw that in. Uh, I can get one more thing or so. Okay, this is the last item I can grab. And I was so close. <sighs> not the best start, I believe, but we have the whole family, we have a radio, we have a map. Uh, there's gonna be a flood, of course. I can I can already taste it. God damn it. Well, all of us made it into a shelter so everyone can put well one can of soup. Oh no. We have way too much water, but not enough soup. Let's hope we can find some on the surface. We do have a gas mask. So I'm fairly certain we're gonna get lucky here. Um I think I'm gonna start with Timmy. Good news, everyone! The government just announced they will be dropping crates full of supplies. Perfect! Perfect. That usually has water and food in them. And sometimes even more useful items. Yep, we got one can of food. At least something. Two cans of food! Never mind, I'm a filthy liar. And two bottles of water. Um... Very good. Very good. Timmy doesn't need much. Has a drink sometimes. Not today. Still gonna send the Timmy. Did I, did, I, did I click on the map? Nope, I did not. I'm gonna send him here, like, in this corner for whatever it's worth. Timmy should go outside. Timmy is our go-to son when it comes to scavenging on the surface. Let's just hope he comes back. He taught, brought the gas mask, so I hope he's gonna be fine and not sick. Okay, yeah, 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 y'all don't have water. You're gonna get it tomorrow. Timmy's gonna be able to drink for himself. That's one thing when they're on the surface. They're n coming back not thirsty. So they've been drinking. Here you go. Water, that is, not alcohol. He's underage. He's not allowed. I wonder, that would be an interesting item, alcohol. It would be a horrible idea to have that in a bunker, by the way. Unless it's cleaning alcohol. Still questionable. Everything seems to be clean. Nobody's complaining about food. And peculiar. Uh, everything's shaking. Well, we're gonna lose our flashlight. That's okay. Still better than a flood. Yeah, it's broken. What a shame. That's why you should get them in plastic. But it's the 1950s or 60s or so. If we're not, nothing is going to stand between us and our daily dose of radio static. We were able to grab it. Yep. Mary Jane's diet code. Food, food, food. Okay. You all get some food from me. Timmy, please. Where did that green puddle come from? Oh dear, a pipe is leaking green goo. No worries, I got the boy, sc boy, boy, boy scout book. And Timmy's back, yay! And he's sick and he broke the... How did you break the gas mask and get sick? Well, probably that's why he got sick. Anyway. Only a handful of buildings in our town survived the blast wave. One of the one was the local bus station. Two bottles of water. That's all we got from it. Could be worse. She could have brought a med kit. How about that, Timmy? Anyway, so, uh, thirsty. Timmy should eat. Well, Timmy, here you have some food. Mary Jane is feeling excellent. Well, guess who we're gonna send out tomorrow then? Mary Jane, that is. All the kids. Send all the kids. I told you, honey, we should have had, like, four more. We could send them all out. Okay, Timmy's very hungry. Lords will not survive without water. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, we're gonna send... Uh, we're gonna give her food, and Timmy food, and Mary Jane goes out. Ah, I'm too scared, I'm gonna send her out with a bottle of water as well. Just so she's fully filled up to her neck with water and food. Just increasing her chances. Okay, now it's water for everyone. Here you go, guys. And if you're lucky, your sister's gonna bring you a med kit. It has become more and more difficult to breathe in the shelter over the last couple of hours. We suspect there's something wrong with the ventilation. Well, let's use the Boy Scout book to fix it. Hopefully no big insects that's going to attack us. When we used the flashlight, we got attacked. Ah, we got sick? Really? How did that happen? Using the handbook to research vent maintenance seemed like a fair idea. We figured it is full of pointers how to fix things. Um, before we could even check, we were invaded by a group of angry mutant insects which flew out of a cursed vent. Their stings hurt like hell and seemed to give us a fever. Ah, damn it. Ted got sick. Well, Timmy, even if your sister brings back... Oh. 
has not been very talkative. Yeah, talk to the Dolores. Um, if your sister brings back a medkit, we're gonna heal Ted. Uh, sorry about that. Really sorry. But the dolls first and kids. <sighs> Something should be done about Ted's sickness. Absolutely agree. Dolores, we talked to her. She's fine. Uh, anyone complaining? Nope. Timmy should eat something. Here you go, Timmy, you greedy guy. Uh, it's high time we stop wondering about what's going on and start asking questions. Yes, let's listen to the radio and figure it out together. Together, we, we can do this if we just stick together. Okay, Ted is shaking. No good. How about getting Timmy something to drink? He's not looking well. Yes, Dolores would like to eat and Ted is hungry. Good. Uh, we're running a little low on food here. Still no event. I hope we're gonna get an event soon. We got a surprising amount of like expedition events when we had no radio last time. Maybe we're gonna get lucky. Uh, Dolores will not survive without water. Yes, you will. And we can keep seating on our backsides. Well, you can. But you shouldn't. So let's listen to the radio and see if the military maybe finally tells us something. Uh, we do have an axe. We do have playing cards. Ah, we don't have a flashlight. The government has not fallen, they're coming to save us. Good. Uh, we need to give him water now, yes. Now it's time for water. We have a situation on our hands. There's a group approaching our shelter and don't seem like the occasional friendly scavengers. Not at all, they look like they're out for blood or cans. Well, we do have our rifle. So we can defend ourselves. We're all good. No worries. And Mary Jane is back and she's sick, but she brought a med kit. Thank you, Mary Jane. I think that's the only thing you brought. Oh, a can of soup, never mind. And a gas mask. Bet I wish you would have worn that before you went out. All right, a few shots were enough to send them home. The hospital had one can of soup, one med kit, and a gas mask. Okay. I guess we can give her food. Ted is gonna get the med kit and yeah, there's someone else that needs food. No, okay. She caught something nasty. Well, sucks for her. I'm gonna send out Dolores now on expedition. We're not alone. There's a huge cherry bunny beast that seems to be hiding in one of the pipes. We can't let it be in here when we sleep. Well, let's chop it to pieces, the bunny beast. I would love to see some, like, bunny ears, like, poking from the uh, screen from the top or so. Uh, what's going on? Our cans are safe. Mary Jane's side could use a little food. Demi is rested. Um, wait, who wanted food? I forgot. Mary Jane, of course. You look like you always want food. Should I feed the kids or should I just... <sighs> ah, we're gonna send Dolores. She's gonna be fine out there. Ted is healed, so I'm not too worried. Unless he gets stung by bees again or some weird beetles. We're good. Mary Jane. Really? More food? More food for everyone? We barely have food left. Kids. How we don't do the f food thing? How we just skip that? You're both sick. We're not feeding you anymore. It's over. Sorry, kids. The thing about the flashlight is that it's really useful if we don't have it. It's like living in medieval times. We don't have a sword, so fixing our flashlight would be a high priority for us. Yes, let's do that. Boy Scout book for the win. No food, kids. I'm sorry. Yeah. Yep, yep. Ted is hungry, though. That's no problem. We fixed the flashlight. That makes me happy. Uh, if we care about the future of our kids, we need to start homeschooling Timmy. I'm pretty sure Timmy cares. Let's homeschool him with the Boy Scout book. I don't think he should read the label on the insect spray. But if we could make... Oh, Mary Jane disappeared. Okay. That's totally understandable. Yeah, when Mary Jane found out she's not getting a single drop of water, she got furious. Alright. Timmy's very hungry. We need to give him water. All right, you know what? I'm gonna give him water and food. Because we might get the event where we can... Oh, we got a med kit back. And we can use it on Timmy. How about that? Or, or, listen to me, or we don't. Gas, ma gas mask was damaged. Timmy's very hungry. Doris would like to eat something. And that is fine. <sighs> well, Timmy, here's the thing. We're gonna send you on an expedition. How about that? If you come back alive, we're gonna help you out. If not, it's it, it sucks for you. Okay, I'm gonna give him uh, food. 
yeah, I'm gonna give him food. Cinema. Today, an army broadcast interrupted our, let's say, breakfast. They seem very eager to evacuate anywhere from here, but they went over several things that need to happen. Uh, they need to meet us. Okay, good. We have the map. I right, don't need to meet us. We need to leave them a message. That's a good start to get into contact. Oh, Timmy's gone. Timmy couldn't handle it. He was very sick, and there's nothing we could have done to make it better. Ah, well. We left the military bus in the bottle. And Dolores wants to eat something. Okay, so we do have hmm, plenty of food. Uh, no, I'm not sending anyone out. I'm going to wait for events. Events are great because they're going to be back right away the next day, unless they're really sick. Oh, you're going to go crazy? Don't go crazy on me. Dehydrated, hungry, crazy. <sighs> Here's some food for you. Please don't break the radio, will you? Damn it, that gas, ma is, gas mask is worthless. Okay, Boy Scout book. I might go out with a gas mask, though. I might consider doing that. Sending out crazy Dolores. Okay, we got it. Fantastic. Uh, foot in the grave. Or Ted. Eh. Alarm! There's a group of people outside that don't seem too friendly. Okay. The neighborhood watch is attacking. Well, guess who we're going to attack? The neighborhood watch with our rifle. Wait, did I miss it? It's day 25, so... The lower side of dehydration. That is surprising. I'm fairly certain it should... Sometimes the game is just... Just trolling me. Anyway. Guess Ted is going to be... <laughs> it's going to be the Ted run. But Ted got some equipment, so that's nice. That is actually quite nice. Uh, does he need anything, by the way? No, he just needs water. No food. Yeah, we're not going to send out Ted. That's not happening. He's gonna just hang out with his wife skeleton. He went crazy. Arrgh. Unless the military comes, we're bad position. How about water? We have plenty of water. He might... He's not gonna give us something. He would give us a gas mask if we didn't have one, but we do. So there's no need to give him water. Our valuable, valuable water. Even though I have way too much. Ted is hungry. Well, Ted. It's your lucky day. I have soup. I have tomato soup for you. Okay, offers two in exchange for a gas mask. Since we don't send Ted out, we can give him the gas mask and get some soup. Okay, I can I can sit this out for quite some time. I can sit this out for quite some time. But... Yeah, good shape for a trip. Nope. Soldiers send out another radio message requesting all survivors in the area remain patient and await further instructions. Sound like the instruction isn't coming as soon as we hoped. Additionally, the officer requested that survivors who are able to bring some gas canisters to the near bus stop should do as soon as possible. Uh, that might take a while, so the only sane idea is to wear a gas mask. Guess what? I just traded in my gas mask. Didn't I just say we don't need it? That's the first time I got this event. I'm 100% sure the game just waited. Oh, he gave away his gas mask? Well, here's an event that you might need your gas mask. Okay. You know what? I'm gonna give a Ted some water because we have so much water. It's not it's not worth it. Uh, take a quick look outside to see if there's trouble in the area. We are about to step out a pair of animal eyes flesh in the darkness. Ooh, it's pancake! The pancake event. Maybe we're gonna have a friend unless Ted runs out of the shelter after that. That would that would really suck. <sighs> okay, uh it was a dog, the person seemed tired. Okay. Hopefully he's back soon. It's really weird when you're getting the feeling someone is watching you. Our shelter's tiny, has been bugging us for a while. We checked all the closets, no one is hiding. Um, maybe a rodent of some kind. We need to show that we're the dominant species. Let's use the axe. I'm a little bit worried that we're gonna shoot ourselves into the foot with the rifle. And I would hate to be injured. Because then we have to use the med kit, and I want to use it on... Pancake. But whatever it was, it's dead now. Whatever bug does, we killed it. Good times, good times. Um, let's see. Trying to best or remain calm. I hope the help comes soon. Where's water when Ted needs it? Here's some water when you need it. Uh, nope. All good. All good. Pancake, come back to us. I can use a buddy because Ted is going insane. I hope that will help his mood. Ted's stomach is rumbling. Got you covered. There's nothing more annoying than silence than all we're getting from a radio, new music, and no talking, no nothing. Ah, uh, no, we're not gonna tinker with it. You're just gonna break it, Ted. Let's not tinker with it. Even though it might have helped with our craziness. 
Ted's middle elf worries us all, but we don't know how to help him. Yeah, I don't think there's a way. Ooh, it's uh, it's 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 pancake. He wants soup. The poor thing seems very hungry. Here's your soup. Got you covered. Okay. So he should come back soon. We decided the dog needs a name, and the name is Pancake. Pancake stayed around for a while, but was gone next morning. Yeah, he will be back soon. Absolutely. It's the army again. Uh, damn it. I need to take a few canisters of gas to a nearby stop. I still don't have a gas mask, unless Pancake will bring me one. I don't think we're gonna get one soon. Should have traded it away, but eh. Was too risky. He needs a drink right now. Right now I'm just giving him as soon as they ask for it, because I don't see a need in rationing it. I could survive another 50 days just with the stuff I have. And I don't think Ted is gonna stay sane that long. Okay. Alarm! The group of people outside the zone seem too friendly. The neighborhood watch is trying to attack again. I got I got you covered. No worries. Yeah, you keep shooting. Okay. Surprising how he stays <laughs> somewhat sane, at least. Uh, Ted seems behaving really oddly. Ah, he's gonna run away soon, isn't he? What was that? Did the radio stop for a moment? Let's try tuning in into that signal. Okay. Radio is always good for mood. So if we can, what happened? Oh, he broke. He used the map. He's becoming more and more absent-minded. Uh, he broke the map. Damn it! He used it as toilet paper. Fantastic. <sighs> Pancake. If you're gonna come back, you should do it now. Cause Ted is really losing it. Like really, really losing it. Ted tries to hide it, but it's obvious he has a lot of issues. He often has lengthy conversations with a sock puppet. I don't like the sound of that. Pancake came back, very agitated about something. He really wanted us to get out and follow him somewhere in the neighborhood. This seemed quite risky. Ah, I don't have the map. What gear should we take? Let's take the axe. I haven't used the axe yet. I used the rifle, which led to him running away. Um, I have the axe. What happened? A man with an axe is a force to be reckoned with. Two of these thugs ran into well. Oh, uh, we ran into while following Pancake learned this the hot way. Pancake was a hero hero, he chased them off and nearly made one of them leave their trousers behind. Not that anyone wanted them. Who would have guessed those two would have a respectable stash of water? Four bottles of water. Fantastic. And Ted is fine. I don't think he's fine. We should do something about the interior decoration. The Feng Shui is really off in the fallout shelter. While we were moving things around, we found a secret door. What's behind it? Let's shoot. Even if we're gonna hit by a ricochet bullet, I don't want to get injured by something else. Oh, there might have been a map in there, right? Eh, damn it. We got two bottles of water. Wow. We hit the 12 bottles of water on the wall. 12 bottles of water on the wall. Bo bo bottle water. Yeah, sure weasel. The game likes to do that. When you don't have an item, it just sends the same event over and over and over and over and over again. Well, I just care for pancake. That's all I care for. Mmm, pancakes. Again, I'm hungry. Can't help it. <sighs> Way too risky to help the armor without using a gas mask. Wait, does he want anything? Oh, I'm missing out on that. Uh, he needs a drink right now. Sure. Never had that much water. Pancake? Every new smell attacks it. There isn't much we can miss, so when a single brick fell out of the wall, revealing a tight opening, our senses immediately invaded by a terrible stench, we should probably check that hole and see what the source of the smell is. Uh, sometimes it hurts us, sometimes we don't. It's a totally random event. I think nothing happened. Oh, actually, we got a can of soup! I looked into the hole, fearing something might come at us with claws, fangs, or other mutated sharp body parts, but it's just a dead rat. Trying to break into the tomato can soup. Okay. Still no pancake. Pancake! He crawled back to us, but he's severely injured. I have a med kit. Yes! Successful pancake run confirmed. We have a dog. Ladies and gentlemen, we have a dog. Ha <laughs> ha! And Ted is not crazy anymore. Yeesh! Fantastic. That is how you turn it around. It took a while, but we were able to patch Pancake up. We're not letting him go this time. Do you know what love is? We should know. Loving your dog. Oh. Ted's stomach is rumbling. He's no longer crazy. The good thing about him now... Ooh! And we can make another medkit with the poison! Yay! We are in a great situation. I think Ted is gonna be fine in terms of... Ah, uh, he got crazy again. Why is... are you... Did you get sick because we made a medkit? We had to test our drugs on someone. Obviously, the adults had to be the lab rats for science. 
so he got crazy again. Here you go. Uh, actually, he don't, doesn't need food. He doesn't need water. Um, well, we're gonna use the medkit we just made on Ted to fix him up again. It's really hard to decipher anything from a rune map, so it'd be a good idea to restore it a bit. Ooh, yeah, with the Boy Scout book. Absolutely, I love the idea of that. Let's just hope that Ted doesn't totally go bonkers. Ah, he ruined the map. Great job, Ted. We completely ruined the damn map. We couldn't blame someone, but it's probably safer to say the paper was of terrible quality. Probably. Okay, at least Ted isn't sick anymore. The trash can is overflowing. I haven't had that in a while. Well, it's day 48. The military is probably not gonna come. Uh, he needs a drink right now, sure. I'm wondering when does Pancake go outside? I love that we have Pancake here. Can I can I pet him and he's barking? I forgot. He should be able to. Good boy, Pancake. Good boy. Ah, so loud. So loud. Ow. Loud. Okay. He's obviously has a lot of issues. Conversation with... Just have a conversation with your doge. Uh, still the gas mask. I think the game really wants me to use the gas mask. The next knock on the door, I'm going to open it in the hope that it helps. Ted isn't complaining much. We didn't pack any razors when come to do down to the shelter and some of us can be confused with a Sasquatch. A good chop axe might be a perfect replacement for a razor. Okay, here's the thing. There is a achievement. Uh, what is it called? Uh, I think Lumber Sexual? Don't, don't let me lie. It's called Lumber Sexual. Trim's Ted Beard the trendy way. Last time I did it, I got injured. Maybe I can get the achievement. Let's see if I successfully can shave my beard with an axe. We failed. <sighs> How did you cut up your arm like that? Well, Ted was hurt. Shit happens. Pancake is quite agitated. Letting him out for a run seems like a good idea. Maybe he will find something interesting. Like a gas mask or a med kit. Please, Pancake. Bring us back some good stuff. Do you bring us back a bottle of water? He brought us back a bottle of water. Good job, Pancake. Good job. Ted is hungry. And he wants water. Seven bottles extra. How many bottles do we have? Thirteen at this point. My lucky number. No expedition is happening. We're pretty much just gonna let this run. Until we get to a point where Ted goes too crazy and runs out. The military comes or... Yeah. The military comes. I'm hoping... Um, we either going crazy or the entire shelter is crawling with little insects or worse. It's worse, they're spiders! Oh yeah. We might get stung by them or we might get some extra soup cans we get when we squash them. Let's see. Mm, nothing of that sort. We got a bottle of water. While chasing them around the shelter we found a misplaced water bottle. 14 bottles of water. I am drowning! I am super drowning. Okay. Uh, Ted is not complaining. Uh, this is terrible. We can't sleep. Oh, no. Oh, no. We don't have a med kit, so Ted is going crazy now. I mean, crazier than before. He's really fatigued. So is a sock puppet. He's thirsty, hurt, crazy, tired, and fatigued. Well, here's some food. Here's some water. I'm just throwing everything I can at him to just make him feel better. And no event. Pancake. Bring us the med kit or poison or anything we can use to heal Ted. Still surprised we didn't get any other. <sighs> it's the gas mask. The gas mask is gonna be my demise. That's what you get for trading away your gas mask. You get. Mm. Never gonna trade again my gas mask again. Did I trade it away for food or for water? If I did for water, I don't feel that it was the best choice. All right, Ted's self is getting worse. How about that radio? Eh, it might help us to get a little less crazy. Uh, he doesn't need anything. Okay, let's listen to the radio. Hopefully it's gonna uncrazy him. Mm, nothing happened. Uh, nothing, nothing, nothing. We could hear nothing but the annoying static. That is really thirsty. Well, it's your lucky day. We have so much water you can drink. Pancake is quite agitated, yes. I think he's just gonna bring water or food. He never brought anything else, and did he bring water again? Good job, Pancake! Pancake, it's... 
it's too much water. Ted has always had a heart of gold. That's why we weren't really shocked to find him feeding our supplies to some disgusting fat cockroach. Both Ted and the bug seemed really happy. Great, Ted. You just gave away your supplies. Good job. Like this man knocking and claiming that he will be offered a lot for decent ammunition. Yep, I'm gonna trade in my ammunition for a soup can. Because that's what we're gonna need. They thick thee. Wait, why did you get sick? How did you get sick again? Ted became infected with something. Ha! Huh. That's a new one. Just just like that. Um, no expedition. <sighs> Things will get ugly. Poor poor Ted can't take it for much longer. Yeah, there's nothing we can do. I was just thinking. Could we, would we be able to do anything? No. <sighs> Pancake, stop looking so cute and adorable. Do something. Um, do, 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 do. There's no way we can send out Ted. There's no way in the first place we could d do that. Doesn't drink anything, he won't last long. It's weird that the game offers you this weird choice to send him out. Our hideaway was approached by a man we didn't know he claimed he used to be an accountant. For a bet of two water bottles, sure. Let's play a card game about two water bottles. Guess what? We might win. No, we lost. Guess what? I really don't care. Ted's stomach is rumbling. Man, what I'm gonna do with two bottles less of water? Um, something or someone is below us. It's only reasonable we could check it out. Uh, let's check it out with an axe. I kind of think that's the alligator hole. So let's go and use the axe to deal with whatever is there. Did we get hurt? Whatever lived on there making... Ooh, we got a gas mask! Gas mask! Yeah! And let me guess, he's gonna die tomorrow. Just because. And we got the transmission for from the army for the gas mask. Finally! Okay. That 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 changes everything. All he wishes for okay, what what does it say? All set, the canisters are in place and we're safely back home. Well, if you can call that. And hopefully for not too long, we will see what the next days will bring. Hopefully the military. Here, have some food, have some water. Last time we went on an expedition, we noticed an abandoned tank. Yeah, I can't say Ted, he's totally sick and crazy. So, no event that does this will help us. Unless there's knocking... Mm. Pancake seems eager to run outside. Sure, bring us back a med kit. If we can heal Tim... Ah, Ted. We're so sad. Nope. Looks like he brought us a bottle of food. Oh, he brought us food. Thank you, Pancake. Uh, Ted might have some nasty scars if those wounds ever heal. Uh, nope. Nobody can go outside again. So, there's two things that can... Nope. And here I was hoping that the military might come around. With some good news. A hunting excursion sounds way too risky. Because Ted is dead now. What a shame. That was actually quite interesting that we got the uh, mask. And could do the... Military thing. I wish there was like an information about how close the army was to coming. But yeah, that was an interesting run. We got Pancake. That makes me happy. I always like it when we have pancake. But we perished. Ah, what a shame. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you would like a certain run or anything like that, let me know in the comments below. I'm Weasel. I'm out. And I hope to see you around. Bye-bye.